Hello, this is John Kitzdanner, and this is another episode of our life here on the farm. And I'm standing within the swale that has been growing up with a mix of plants. You can compare it to the rest of the uh, pasture on this hillside. Um, it is the green strip that is the haven for uh, ladybugs and all kinds of uh, spiders and beneficial insects. And what the uh, tall plants are that I'm standing right next to, that I'm chopping down, are a sorghum, sorghum sudan grass, um, but we also have some buckwheat down here. Um, let me kind of focus in on that. There we go. Um, there's some buckwheat. We got some purple um, flowered vetch in here. We've got some annual oat and rye, and uh, I am chopping this down for a couple reasons. Um, one, let me show you. Where, oh, right, right behind me. I'm about to step on. Is our um, the trees that we have in here. This is a black locust and then up a little bit further I've got a pawpaw um, and then an apple, another black locust, a red bud, some nitrogen fixing plants in here uh, along with all of these other plants that I have been chopping with this little um, just garden clippers uh, chopping about thigh high uh, and this is going to do a few things. One it's going to allow more light to get down to these trees um, the hot sun, um, this, we've had a lot of hot weather lately with not a lot of rain and this, this canopy of sorghum and uh, buckwheat have been doing a really good job of protecting these trees. Um, but we got some more rain coming on the forecast and, um, and so I'm clearing this out. The, it, it's going to let more light into the trees, um, so the trees can build some more, um, growth on their, um, uh, of their own. But it's also, I'm basically doing a chop and drop right here. I'm just, as I chop, everything just falls to the ground. That's going to add more biomass, um, organic matter to this uh, depleted soil. And so that is what I've got going on here. And I thought I'd give you an update so you all can see exactly what it is I'm doing. Uh, but that's it for now. This is John Kitzsteiner standing in a swale in Bulls Gap, Tennessee.